Yes, guys, we are at it again. Another space, another refresh. Hello, guys, and welcome to Vandessa J. I am Vandessa J, and today, guys, we will be working here in my guest bathroom. And um, we had some work done in here and the workers really messed up our bathroom. So I did not like it. So I was just like, it is time to give the bathroom a complete refresh anyway. So therefore guys, it is time for us to do this bathroom. So let's go ahead and refresh our guest bathroom. Hello guys, welcome back to Vandessa J. Well today guys, we will be working in the guest bathroom. We had some work done and the workers mess up the bathroom pretty bad, so I want to give the bathroom a refresh, and these are the products that I did clean the bathroom with. I love these bathroom products, and this is not sponsored, but guys, Zap is the business. I no longer use anything else to clean our home, only Zap. So I did purchase mine from Lowe's. So guys, now let's go ahead and get this bathroom all together. Sugar, when you're close to me, you love me right. 
Okay guys, this is our guest bathroom. So now that I have put things together, I am absolutely loving our space once again. Um, I'm going to say this and I'm going to have to tag my cousin to it. Um, when we had Amber's graduation um, dinner here from high school graduation, of course she's getting ready to graduate from college in a few more months, um, my cousin came in here and she came back out, she was just like, I can just stay in the bathroom. Just give me a pillow and a blanket. And I was like, what are you talking about? She was like, that bathroom is together. So guys, that is the type of response I would like to have in our guest bathroom. And indeed, my cousin, she gave me that compliment. So what I like to do in the bathroom is give it an oasis, although they are only coming in here, there's no shower, no tub, but when they come in, for one, I want it to smell good. For two, I want all of my decor together. For three, I wanna make sure I have toilet tissue stack, white stack, soap stack. Um, I don't use um, paper towels in here, so I do have the hand towels here, and they're just washcloths, and I get them from Walmart and also Dollar Tree, so I usually have a basket down here on the floor, but unfortunately, we had an issue with our toilet, so my husband called a company in, and guys, I wouldn't tell you no lie, I should have shown y'all from the beginning 
the walls was nasty. They destroyed my basket, all of the just beauty towels that I had in there. They took that, they had water all over the floor. They didn't ask any questions. They didn't say anything. They just grabbed all of my towels and stuff and just stopped sopping up the water. But guess what they did after? They put it in the basket to act like nothing ever happened. So I was very upset about that because if you know I do shop on a budget, but that don't mean I don't want anyone coming in messing up my items. So that really perturbed me a lot. So um, I do have to purchase another basket probably to go in here, but um, we don't have that much company, so therefore not having a basket will be perfectly fine. I am gonna be adding a flower in here because um, if you don't know, it gives oxygen, but also if TMI, somebody come in and do a poodaloo, um, although I have freshener in here and I have candles in here, a plant oxidizes that. So, I mean, it's not going to oxidize just like that, but I mean, you know, you know. So, I am going to add a plant in here and I might add that plant in while I am before I end this video. But guys, other than that, you probably hear an echo because I have a door closed. Um, but other than that, guys, I brought these pictures down from the master bathroom. And I do love those pictures back down here. And of course, with the mirror, you know, I tell you, this mirror used to be at my office. So I decided that I was so sick of the grade, the builder grade mirror that long over mirror oh i was so tired of that mirror so i decided to bring my white my round gold frame mirror here because in here is touches a black gold wood and then you have the taupe tan color so i do love this bathroom so no one in my household have seen the bathroom since i have done it because i don't know what time it is i'm about to look at my your girl don't even wear watches but other than that, guys, I think it is very nice. And you probably asked me, Vandessa, why didn't you add a towel there? The reason why I did not add a towel there, this is just now just for just cute decor. It's just sitting there. It's gold. It, it, it match well. That's more of a bronzy color, but it does match um, along with the black. Um, I did not add a towel there because in the guest bathroom, I know you probably say, hey, that's tower, that's decor, but it does not function well in our household because that only collect dust. And if you don't have people, if you want to put that up and it's just for cute, you're breaking down the material of the towers. So I no longer put hand towels up there. Um, I have washcloths here to dry hands off, and also I have Kleenex up here. So if you're just coming in and you're blowing your nose, you're not wasting up my tissue. You have Kleenex back there, okay? And I also wanted the Kleenex to mimic the color of the bathroom, so I did find those Kleenex from Kroger, and it comes in a set of four for like $13. Um, it might be, yeah, I think it was like $10 to $13 for four of them. So it is perfectly, it, it matches in here. And because, so guys, this is our guest bathroom. Hope you did enjoy it. If it's something, I'm going to tell you right now. I used to tell you all where some of the things came from. Some of this stuff is thrifted. All of my Sherlock home books were thrifted from Goodwill for $0.25 cents a piece. Um, the black boxes that I got, the toilet tissue and the wipes, they both came from Ross Department Store. The tall lanterns, um, I guess you're planners, I guess you would call it. Um, I got those from Ross Department Store, all three of them, and I got them about a year and a half, maybe two years ago. The elephant I got from a yard sale. Um, the chain that is on the elephant, they are a DIY. I made those out of snakes from the Dollar Tree wooden snakes. Um, the girl, I did get that from Ross Department Store. Um, where else? The picture frames, I think I put those up from Goodwill. And the prints, I just print those. Um, 
everything else that is where it came from you know your girl always shop on a budget no matter what so everything that's in here was actually other yard sale goodwill or on clearance yes the only thing that i purchased full price for was the hand towers and they were a full pack for a dollar at dollar tree the other white ones they were 44 cents i think at walmart so that's like a clearance in itself so the only item guys throughout this whole entire bathroom that i paid a full price for would be the Kleenex. But I don't know if that would be considered full price because I had a coupon for it and I did get $2 off. So therefore, your girl is saving coins again. So guys, please like, comment, subscribe, thumbs up my video. Please do share it out. Tell a neighbor and tell a friend. And you know what I said, all of my videos, I gotta go, but I will be back with another space. Until then, bye guys. Bye.